What's up, Bully fam? Look, man, you know who it is. You know what it is, man. So today's video, we're going to be talking about deposits. We're going to be talking about refunds, man. How I go about doing that, man. My contracts. All of that good fun stuff, man. So you don't want to miss this video, man. Y'all stay tuned. What's up, everybody? This is Mo Kennel. All right, look, man. So deposits, right? Deposits are really important, you guys. Uh, first of all, every dog, every service, that we offer typically requires a deposit, okay? So the price range for the deposits can vary. Sometimes, you know, if you're just acquiring for a stud service on Bolo or Demon, that deposit is normally $250. And so what that $250 does is it holds you at a locked-in rate, okay? So Bolo's price is not gonna change for his stud fee. Uh, he's, he's pretty much at a flat rate, $750. That's how much I'm gonna ask for Bolo. If you wanna use them, it's 750. Uh, and in some cases, I'll do a pup back deal just to get you know that breeding done. And I really, really like the female. But uh, most cases, he's $750 with a $250 lock-in. So once you pay the $250 lock-in, then you owe me 500 at the time of the breeding. Um, it's a little different when I'm shipping semen. So when I'm shipping semen, I have to go get a box. I have to get a extender. Uh, I have to get, you know, certain things to to be able to make the semen stay fresh for it to last to you. And so typically it's that $750 plus the price of that box and shipping. So shipping next day, shipping is typically around $300. So you got $300 for the shipping, you got $750 for the stud fee, and then you'll be paying, you know, uh, about another $200 for the box. So you add all that up, that's how much a stuffy for bolo typically costs when you're out of state now in state obviously you don't have to worry about shipping so um in state is just one of those things where you know i got my puppies over here y'all my puppies in here they they want attention they don't want me to be all on the phone talking to the world right now they want they want all the attention right now so but um so typically when you're doing a local breed when we're doing a local breed for bolo or demon uh, it's just 750 plus the box and the AI kit, man. The AI kits, I know I do my AIs, I do my own AIs, I charge a uh, hundred dollars for the AI. Um, haven't really missed much, uh, you know, when I think about it, I've done a lot of breedings with Demon, I've done a lot of breedings with Bolo, and I haven't really missed much. I think I pretty much got the AI thing down, man. And so, Demon Stuffy is uh, pretty much the same right now. Uh, right now, he's at 750 at a locked in rate, um, but once he turns two. He'll go up to 1500 and that'll require a $500 deposit just to lock him in at that rate. So let's just say, let's just say you get a stud fee from uh, Demon tomorrow or today and you lock him in at $250, $750 and then you're like, Mo, I can't use it on my girl, man. I don't, she's not going to be ready until next year. That's fine, man. The price is not going to change even though he turns two before next year. Even though he turns two before next year, the price wouldn't change. Um, you still be locked in at that rate for 750 So, um, really important. Make sure you guys pay attention to that because you can lock in Demon at 750 right now. You can lock Demon in at 750 right now. And, you know, still pay 750 next year whenever your female comes in to do the breeding, right? Um, also, if you do a breeding that she does not take, if we do a breeding that she does not take, I will allow to repeat that breeding all the way until she does take. I'm not like most breeders. Oh, you only get two. But what I will say is you can't switch females, all right? It has to be with the same female. I won't let you breed to another female. It has to be to the exact same female. And we'll knock it out until she takes or, you know, until you get tired of trying. But like I said, I got Demon. I got Bolo. They're a bunch of honey dogs. They don't really miss too much, all right? They ready to go. As long as you do your due diligence with the vet, the progesterones, and you know, we're making sure that your dog is ready, ready to go. We're gonna get it done. We're gonna knock it out. The dog's gonna take, you're gonna have puppies. Um, Demon and Stone Litter is uh, now seven. Uh, I think his biggest litter was seven. Bolo Stone a 10 piece. So, you know, we're gonna, we're gonna really bless you. We're gonna bless your camp, man. We're gonna get you right. Um, so, as far as refunds go on those deposits, so look, all deposits are non refundable. Okay, a deposit is non-refundable. Um, a deposit is your commitment to what you're gonna do. So if I'm gonna place a deposit on something, I'm gonna make sure that I'm gonna withhold that deposit. I'm gonna make sure I'm gonna withhold them payments. I do take payment plans, y'all. Um, I work with 
just about anybody in every situation. It's not too many situations where I don't work with the customer, when I don't work with, uh, you know, somebody who has, you know, life happening in, in the middle of them trying to purchase a dog. I do. I completely understand that, y'all. I completely understand how life can happen while you're in the middle of trying to make a big purchase or get something that you really, you really, really want. So, um, only time that I do refund is if, let's say I have a litter born and you place a deposit on them within the first two or three weeks. And then you come to me another like three or four days later or a week later, like, Mo, I'm not going to be able to do this, man. I thought this, but it's really that, um, you know, as long as you don't go over about seven to 10 days with that deposit, man, I'll go ahead and shoot you their bread back, you know, and there's no hard feelings. I mean, it's, in some cases, I look I, about two weeks. OK, but after two weeks is over and, you know, you, I've been talking to you, I've been communicating with you because I like to talk to everybody at least once a week, touch bases. Even if I drop a YouTube video and you see the video, you know, I still like to text or call. Just kind of, you know, get a heads up and stay updated with my, with my, with my, with my, with my support system. So, um, normally after two weeks, man, the deposit is gone. I do have a contract that states that all deposits are non-refundable. And that's soon as you drop it. But, you know, like I said, man, I'm, I'm human and I do realize that we all, you know, everything isn't perfect. Everything doesn't always go down the way that we plan it to go down. So I am also always willing to work with whoever needs to work with. All right. Whoever needs to be worked with. I'm always willing to work with. Why are you talking so much stuff, man? Why are you talking so much stuff? I got to be talking to y'all for y'all to be quiet, huh? I got to be talking to y'all, huh? Y'all see that? Y'all see how they, they quiet and I start talking to them. But now that I'm back focused on you guys, we're going to start working again. But... So that's how the refunds go with the deposits, man. Uh, typically, I do not refund no deposits after about three weeks. After three weeks, I feel like your level of commitment should already be there. You should know if you're going to be able to get this dog or not. Um, and so you, you've had enough time to, you know, get your situations figured out. And so right now, in a situation where the mail from Demon and Siri, I had a deposit dropped on them. And this was about, you know, four or five weeks ago. Uh, uh, the guy kept saying, man, Mo, I need a little bit more time. I need a little bit more time. I need a little bit more time. And I've been giving it to him, uh, um, gracefully. Um, the payments only remaining on his dog is only $2,500. So I haven't really been hassling him about making another payment. Um, so I've just been kind of just waiting, sitting back and seeing if he was going to, you know, uphold his end of the bargain. So long story short, uh, this puppy is back available. Uh, I'm going to show him real quick so you guys can see him. Show them to you guys so you can see them real quick. That's this boy right here. I hate doing these on the... There we go. So this boy right here is back available, y'all. No, he doesn't have a full tail. But massive. And exactly what you really want in the bull, y'all. So I do got this boy available. Um, like I said, Bart backed out. He didn't want to commit to him. So he is available, y'all. He is available. Very, very tiny micro boy. Very, very, very tiny micro boy. And so he is available. You go ahead and hold the rest of the post up too. I'm liking this boy though, man. He may stay, man. I mean, I mean, I ain't gonna cap with y'all. He not staying. He's available, y'all. He is available, y'all. He is available, y'all. Let me know what y'all think. Uh, he'll just be twenty five hundred dollars, man. I already got the already got five hundred deposit on him, so I'm only asking for the remaining twenty five hundred for this boy. And you know, you can have you a very very nice demon son, fully functional movement, everything like that is good to go. So I also had this treatment right here, y'all. This is a demon daughter, and these puppies are they'll be twelve weeks. They'll be twelve weeks this coming weekend, man. They just turned eleven weeks on Saturday, so. I have this female available as well. She'll be two thousand. She's two thousand plus shipping. Uh, if you need to be shipped, if you're local, she's just a flat. You know, a flat rate of two thousand, y'all. Very, very thick female. Very, very thick female. She's short. She's compact. And uh, you know, what I'm saying it's a demon daughter. She's up to date on everything, just like all the rest of the puppies are. Uh, she ain't missing the beat, y'all. She ain't missing the beat, y'all.
It's the last demon daughter we got. Well, actually, this isn't the last demon daughter, but this is another demon daughter. She's 2000 as well, y'all. 2K plus shipping on these females, man. You can't can't really beat that, y'all. Can't really beat 2000 for a demon daughter. Siri. The genetics, the blood on these puppies, the pedigree on these puppies are crazy. Especially if you went to that exotic stuff, man. The pedigree on these puppies are crazy, y'all. So, yeah, she's available at $2,000. $2,000 plus shipping. Hit me up, man. Let me know what y'all think about her, man. Got another female available. So I do got this pup available as well. This female is available as well. More, more, more like the uh, the first pup, like the male. This is pretty much her, his twin. And so she'll be available as well, y'all. Very, very nice pup, like I said, man. Short, compact, thick. She's a little bit smaller than the other two females. The other two females are a little bit taller, a little bit bigger than her. But uh, once again, like everybody else, man, she, actually she's 2,500. This will be the only one that's 2,500 plus shipping. Uh, the other two females are 2,000 plus shipping. And her brother is 2,500 plus shipping because I already received a deposit on him. So she's 2,500, he's 2,500, and the other two females before her are 2,000, y'all. So that's really what it is, man. You see my girl. She was always on, she was almost on the list. She has a full tail. She's really complete, y'all. She's really complete, y'all. I ain't even gonna lie. It's a complete pup right here. I love her. Really, really love what I'm seeing out of this girl, y'all. So, Bully World, that's it, man. You've seen everything that I got to offer right now as far as uh, availability, what's for sale, what's not for sale. Um, as you can see, every single thing, every single puppy that I have over here is for sale. Um, not planning on keeping anybody, but I am getting a pup back from a breeding that I did with Mokino Demon that I'm excited about. Uh, she'll possibly be staying here. It is a female or a male. I'm not sure right now I think it's gonna be the female man. So uh, I think I got something that you guys are really 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 gonna like man I ain't really showed her to nobody. I haven't presented her to YouTube Instagram Facebook and none of that so Really just kind of waiting. I'm loving the way these puppies are developing, you know, hopefully my dog over at Raw Dog Kennels is still taking very, very good care of the puppies, which I'm exact. I'm sure he is. I ain't no doubt in my mind. I know he sure is. So shout out to my dog Don over at Raw Dog Kennels, man, who invested in his time and his energy into doing the breeding with Mo Kennel Demon. And uh got man, four beautiful, beautiful puppies, man. I can't wait for y'all to see these dogs, man. I'm talking about massive, massive, massive puppies, massive head, massive body, massive everything. You know what I'm saying? So man, look forward to that video dropping here soon. Other than that, man, though, we've covered deposits, we've covered refunds, we've covered what's available. If you got any further questions, man, leave it down in the comment section, or you can go ahead and hit me up, man. I'll leave my phone number in the comment in the uh, description as well. So this is Derek Mokeno. Peace.